Okay, so in these problems, they're asking us to identify different aspects or features of the parabola in the graph. So the parabola is the graph of a quadratic. So that means somewhere along the way we have something, uh, some variable being squared. And here, they want to know what the axis of symmetry is. Imagine in a parabola, right, if your parabola is like this, let's say, that's a terrible drawing, I'll fix that. If your parabola is something like this. The line of symmetry is the line around which you can fold the parabola. It's the line that separates two equal regions of the parabola, and it always crosses the vertex. So we have the vertex right here. They ask you to label that. The vertex is the maximum point, or if you have a parabola like this, then the vertex is the minimum point, right? But either way, the, par the parabola is symmetrical about this axis right here. It's the line of symmetry or the axis of symmetry and it splits your parabola, parabola in, in two equal pieces. So here, where's our line of symmetry? Well, you can draw the line about here, right? And then the definition for that line is x equals 3. Since for all the points on this line, the x value is always equal 3. For example, this point here, the x value is 3, the y value is 4. So there, the x value is 3. And here for this point, um, we have the point 3, 8. In all of these points, the x value is 3. Don't be, don't be too quick here to pick y equals 3. Remember, the, the line y equals 3 will be a line where the height of the line is always 3, where the y value is always 3. That would be a horizontal line like this. So here, the axis of symmetry is the line x equals 3.